Okay, Eliezer, let's look at this problem. Would you read the problem, please? Sure. X take away 3 star plus 2 equals 8 take away 2x. Yes, now how would you proceed to do this? I would put down one pawn, which is represented as x, and take away 3 stars. I would add 3 convenient 0. And now I can further go and at this stage take away 3 star plus 2 equals 8 take away 2x. Now we don't have 2x's to take away, so what would you be doing in order to take them away? Um, I'll be adding convenient 0 twice. And now? Now I can take away 2x. Okay, so you now have the original physical setup of this example. How would you solve it, please? Um, do a, a legal move. Okay, go ahead. Or add a blue pawn to each side. And how would that help? And therefore, it would help because this becomes a convenient zero. Mm -hmm. This is zero value, so I can just take it off. Yes. Therefore, simplifying the problem. Mm -hmm. And I can add a blue pawn to each side again. Yes. And now? And do this again. Yes. So, apparently, pawn equals one. Each x is equal to one. Okay, how do you know each x is equal to one? Uh, because one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And the other side we have eight again. Okay, so each x is equal to one. Okay, let me write down the answer. Uh, x is equal to one. Now, if x is equal to one, what would the value of star be? Star would be negative one. Okay, star is the opposite of x, so it would be negative one. Could you please do the check? Let's see if that solves the original example. Sure. Clear the scale. Set up x, take away three star. Okay, so you didn't have any stars to take away. So in order to take them away, you first added three convenient zeros. Okay, now what can you do? Take away three star. Okay, please continue. And add two. Yes, and on the other side? Eight, take away two x. Okay, so you've now taken away two x's, so now you have the original physical setup. Would you please see to see uh, check to see if x equals one and star equals negative one works? Would you check sure. that, please? Um, this one, two, three, four, six, and eight minus two, since star is negative one, equals six. Okay, so the check would be six is equal to six. So let me write down the check value. So the check would be 6 is equal to 6. Okay, Eliezer, thank you very much.